Season 3 update is going to be the biggest update of Warzone Mobile after global launch. This is going to be first major update of Warzone Mobile after global launch. Season 3 updates are ready to drop on April 3rd, 9am Pacific time in all the platform. Season 3 is also going to be the biggest content drop update of Warzone Mobile. But before that if you are new here do not forget to subscribe. And also check out my second channel I have uploaded the best settings and sensitivity video for touch player along with the most asking AMR9 loadout. You can check out after watching this video link is in description. We are going to get our first ever official global version battle pass in season 3. If you are not aware then Warzone Mobile was released with an old season 2 reloaded battle pass which now is going to end in few days. And we are going to get new season 3 battle pass for global version in Warzone Mobile. Here are all new characters of Warzone Mobile season 3 battle pass. There are some more operators will be in Season 3 Battle Pass, soon I will upload a separate Warzone Mobile Season 3 Battle Pass video. Apart from that I have a sad news, Rank Mode and Training Room is now postponed. But Season 3 brings an additional 200 levels and 4 additional Prestige 10, 11, 12 and 13. For you to unlock. At launch the level cap is raised from 450 to 650. New free daily login reward is also looking pretty good. You will also receive a free gift on April 3rd in the celebration of an incredible 4-year anniversary milestone. Here are all new Season 3 weapons which are coming in Season 3 of Warzone Mobile. Rust from MW2 is coming in Warzone Mobile. New mode like Plunder where you have to drop in Verdanx and have to loot cash to be top earning squad in the end when time expire to win respawn will be available with your selected loadouts. By back Battle Royale where Gulag will be closed and Rebirth Island is adding UAV tower to know the location of nearby enemies. Event The Keep means Locky Draw will also feature in Season 3. Some more new aftermarket parts where you can say new attachments are also coming to customize some weapons.